Welcome to Creole Florida Living. <laughs> Welcome to Creole Florida Living. We're fixing to do a key lime pie. You're being on that video now. We're going to do a key lime pie from scratch itself for the pie crust. And it's only three ingredients. We'll be back at you. On the key lime pie, I actually got this recipe from a YouTube channel called Tug Trash Outdoors. Y'all check him out. He's around St. Augustine, I believe. He's not far from Jacksonville. But you can make your own or buy a graham cracker crust, one can of sweetened condensed milk. Now, he uses fresh key limes. I don't have any. But if you can't get fresh limes, key limes, buy the, the Key West lime juice and give that a shot. And it's a half a cup of lime juice. And I'm going to use two eggs. Now you can do the egg yolk or separate them or whatever how you want to do it. Or one egg, but I'm going to use two eggs. You mix it all in a bowl. You preheat the oven at 350 and you cook it for about 15, 20 minutes. But we'll show you the process and we're going to get everything together. I'm actually doing quite a few videos at one time. I got all kinds of stuff going on. But we'll be back at you. Yeah. We're cooking fish. We ain't catching fish, but we're cooking fish. All right. On the key lime pie, we're going to go on and get our ingredients. One can of condensed milk. Get out. Got to get all that goodness out. We're going to preheat the oven to 350. Now, we want half a cup of key lime juice or fresh limes. Alright, key lime juice. Get that in there. Spoon up. Two eggs. Hey, we got farm fresh eggs. Thanks to a friend of mine. He has chickens. He shares the eggs with folks. That was going to keep going. One egg. Now you can separate them. I just do the whole egg. Stir it up. Really need a, a whisk would work. I don't even know if we have one. It probably got caught in the drawer and got tossed. Oh, what am I talking about? We got a bunch of them. Just a little whisk. That spoon out. 
There we go. Get a whisk. Get this stuff stirred up. It's simple, man. Simple recipe. Got the graham cracker shell. You can make your own or just store bought. <clears throat> just pour it in there. Smooth it out a little bit. And there you go. Let that oven get heated up. Then usually after that, you want to get it chilled in the refrigerator for a good hour at least. Comes out great, simple, great man, great pie. Florida, Florida key lime pie. All right, we'll uh, be back when the oven's preheating. I'm sliding in the oven. Oh, and I say a can of condensed milk. It is 14 ounce can, the 14 ounce can, which I'm pretty sure that's how they usually come, normal cans. I don't do a whole lot of baking, so I'm not sure. I'm just throwing that in there. The oven is preheated. Definitely put it on a pan, or I am. Well, you got something to grab to get it out. So about 15 to 20 minutes, I guess it depends on your oven. I've done 15 and I'll push it up to almost 20. So we have, my battery died on me. I was trying to show y'all the clock. We got, it's been about 18 minutes. We're gonna go on and pull it. Uh, but you know, 15 to 20 minutes, your preference. what we got oh that's nice Ooh. that's nice now what we're gonna do is we will let it cool off for about 20 30 minutes and then we're gonna put it in the refrigerator all right we're gonna put the lid on the key lime pie and let it chill Eh, some of the crust fell down, it'll be all right. We're gonna go put it in the refrigerator and let it chill for about an hour. Thank y'all for watching. Creole Florida Living. Please like, share, and subscribe. Till next time, peace.